Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Tucked away in a family plot in the Natchez City Cemetery is a tombstone marking the final resting place of Eli A. Montgomery, who died on this day August 14, 1864, while the dates on the tombstone 1849 to 1864 indicate a short life for the young man. It is the inscription which gives one pause. A mere 14 or 15 when he died, Eli Montgomery was one of the youngest Natchez soldiers to die in the Civil War. Eli was the youngest son of a family that had connections to some of the earliest Natchez families. The Montgomery family lived at Hope Farm, the former home of Carlos de Grand Prix. Spanish commandment of the Natchez district from 1780 to 1792, Eli joined Company H of the 33rd Mississippi Infantry, also known as Hearst Regiment, which would eventually become part of the 22nd Regiment of the Mississippi Infantry. Unfortunately, Eli Montgomery would never take part in battle. The company left him in Greenwood, Mississippi, a sick 14-year-old private. He was transferred to a hospital in Jackson on May 30th. Eli Montgomery died in Lauderdale Springs Hospital, Lauderdale County, Mississippi, on August 14th, 1864. His parents buried him in the family plot in the Natchez City Cemetery, erecting the stone emblazoned with the epitaph, Victim of War. Hi, my name is Madeline Falkenhunter. I'm a senior at Trinity Episcopal Day School, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.